From the earliest days of our existence, humans have sought to understand the world around them. We have striven to measure and quantify, to make sense of the vastness of the cosmos and the intricacies of the atom. Measurement is the foundation upon which we build our knowledge of the universe. It allows us to compare, to analyze, to predict, and ultimately to comprehend. Imagine a world without measurement. How could we build houses, design machines, or even bake a cake? Without standardized units, communication would be riddled with ambiguity. Recipes would be rendered useless, construction projects would descend into chaos, and scientific progress would grind to a halt. Measurement is more than just a practical necessity. It is a testament to our innate curiosity and our desire to make sense of the cosmos. It is a tool that empowers us to explore the unknown, to push the boundaries of human understanding, and to shape our world in profound ways. For much of human history, measurement was a localized affair. Different cultures developed their own unique systems, often based on readily available references like body parts or natural phenomena. The ancient Egyptians, for example, used the cubit, a unit of length based on the distance from the elbow to the tip of the middle finger. The Romans, on the other hand, favored the pace, which corresponded to the length of a double step. While these systems served their purpose within their respective cultures, they created a confusing patchwork of units across the globe. A distance measured in cubits in Egypt would have a completely different value in Rome, leading to misunderstandings and inefficiencies in trade and communication. The lack of a standardized system of measurement hampered scientific progress as well. Scientists working in different parts of the world struggled to compare their findings, hindering the advancement of knowledge. The need for a universal language of measurement was becoming increasingly clear. The 18th century witnessed a growing movement towards standardization. The French Revolution, with its emphasis on reason and logic, provided fertile ground for the development of a universal system of measurement. In 1790, the French National Assembly commissioned a group of scientists to create a system that was both rational and practical. The result was the metric system, a decimal system based on the meter. The meter, defined as one ten millionth of the distance from the North Pole to the equator, provided a stable and reproducible standard for measuring length. Other units, such as the gram for mass and the liter for volume, were derived from the meter, creating a coherent and interconnected system. The metric system, with its elegance and simplicity, quickly gained popularity in Europe. It facilitated trade, streamlined scientific communication, and paved the way for technological advancements. The world was finally beginning to speak a common language of measurement. Section 4, the SI system, a triumph of collaboration. The metric system evolved into the International System of Units, or SI, adopted by most of the world. The SI system has seven base units, meter, kilogram, second, ampere, kelvin, mole, and candela. The SI system is a testament to international collaboration, showcasing what humanity can achieve together. Section 5. Precision in Science and Technology. The importance of standardized units in science cannot be overstated. From the intricate calculations of quantum mechanics to the vast distances of astronomy, scientists rely on the SI system to ensure accuracy and reproducibility in their work. Without standardized units, scientific progress would be severely hampered. The field of medicine also relies heavily on precise measurements. Drug dosages, for example, are often measured in milligrams or even micrograms, and even the slightest error can have serious consequences. Standardized units allow medical professionals around the world to communicate effectively and administer treatment safely. Section 6. The global marketplace and beyond. Standardized units are essential for global trade. Imagine buying fabric in cubits and selling rope in feet. Confusion and error would be immense. The SI system provides a common language for businesses fostering economic growth. As we venture into the cosmos, a universal measurement language is critical. Coordinating a Mars mission with different units could be catastrophic. The SI system ensures international cooperation in space exploration and beyond. <laughs>